Hey, you love to see it. A black man thinking for himself. The ultimate fear of the Democratic Party. He is literally kryptonite to them. Folks, I bring you writer, content creator, YouTuber, musician, Eric July. After getting tired of all the woke garbage being inserted into comic books and movies, Mr. July decided to create his own comic book called The Ripperverse. His first issue became a huge success after bringing in $1.7 million in the first four days. But ever since his success of creating a non-woke comic book, the left, you know, the same people that say we need to support and uplift black voices, you know, diversity and inclusion, support black businesses. Yeah, they've been viciously attacking Mr. July. All because he doesn't align himself with their woke ideology. It's obvious that he doesn't see himself as a victim. He pulled himself up by the bootstraps. It's clear that he doesn't think that there's people on the 13th floor holding him back. Instead, he believed in himself and applied hard work, created a product, people liked it, and they bought it. Simple concept.